Just like that. I want to talk about the culture of hip hop because actually like the same thing that's happening in the States, like it's happening in Europe, like skills don't matter anymore. It's all about the image. It's all about like portraying money, bitches, parties, clubs, but we grew up on another generation, you know, like we listen to real hip hop, like people who actually talk about things that matter, politics, racism, economics, whatever, you know, like people that matter, people that actually say stuff, not like some waka flaka that like talks about nothing, you know, like, so that's, that's what we about, that's what we about. You know? Well, the thing is like in France, they used to have like really good hip hop, but they used to sample like native music from France, you know, like the guys used to do over here in the States, they used to sample like soul and like uh, funk music, you know, but now they're like start copying like the crunk and the dirty south music, only like uh, electronic shit, you know, and synthesizer. Yeah. And of course there's good songs, there's good songs among them, but a lot of bullshit too, you know, and it's stupid that they start copying instead of like keep their own, their own style, their own like, their own thing, you know. So that's that's uh, that's like really sad. Kids in France and kids in Belgium, the main problem there is like they don't know anymore. They see Drake on TV, they see 50 Cent on TV, and they never saw like the real hip hop stuff. Like when we were growing up, we had Yo MTV raps, and that's mm. what we saw. We saw B.I.G. doing live stuff on TV. Right. So when he got shot, you, you felt, felt it. it. Felt it. Even though you were small, you felt it. Right. And now they're they're just like. Oh, Drake, he sings an auto-tune. Oh, yeah, I love it. <laughs> so they buy themselves auto-tune and buy an M-Box, and they start rapping like Drake and Lil Wayne and stuff like that, because that's what they see on TV, and that's what they think sells. But mm. it doesn't sell. Right. The shows make money, right. because the media plays into it, mm -hmm. and they like they portray him as like this great, great artist. Right. It's like really amazing. And, and that's why, why they, they get paid like ridiculous amounts of money for a show. And that's why... Us cats, you know, like, we down there. Mm. It's a bit like the culture is gone. Like, you ask a kid who raps, who's like 15 years old, and he raps, and he raps stuff like Drake and shit, and you ask him, do you know Naughty by Nature? Do you know OPP? Do you know Hip Hop Parade? He will not know it. He will know how to play and jump around because DJ Dysfunctional spins it at the party where he goes to. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he knows because I've been bumping it for years. Yeah. Right. As, to be honest, like, I tried to, because as a DJ, you know, you always get like the new younger generation come to your party. So what I do is like, I play some new music, but I try to like take the good songs out of it. And I mix it up with old school classics. So in between the commercial and the more known, known stuff, you know, I mix like old school rap. I mix like Naughty by Nature, KRS One, Big L, like uh, Guru, Gangstar, you know. So Notorious B.I.G. shit, Tupac, mm. like the old school stuff. And that way, like you can like school them, you know, because that's the job from a DJ. I think like a DJ mm -hmm. is there to entertain the people, make them dance, but at the same time, you have to bring out new music, like, and also, like, teach them about where it comes from. Because mm. you don't know where you're going to if you don't know where you're coming from. Yeah. That's my opinion mm. about it, you know? That's hot. You gotta That's know, hot. like, the classic, the foundation. You gotta know that. Because okay. there's a new generation coming who grew up on Soldier Boy. And they don't know about, hip-hop used to be about skills, about b-boying, graffiti, yeah. rapping, DJing. There's no about skills. Elements. About skills, you know. Mm. They forgot the four elements. Yeah. That's, mm. that's what he's saying. Like, yeah, Lil Wayne and Drake, and they, they represent. They're good rappers. They're really good. But they don't represent anymore. Yeah, they talk about getting money, getting pussy, and that's it. That's it. That's While it. We used to Cars, cars rocks, and rings. Everything, is, everything has to be big. Great right. Song is nails done, hair done, everything big. Right. So, and that doesn't represent regular people. It definitely does. Look at us too. We've been like playing for, for I don't know, I've, I've been on stage for, for like nine years now or something. We've so been on stage for ten years battling and stuff. And still we we have to live from month to month. We have to see what we can get. Sometimes we don't eat. Right. And that's how it is. But we love it. You know, right. it's, it's our life. We keep doing it. Mm, that's hip-hop. That's hip-hop.